you're very you're, you're an asset to the community, man. You keep it positive. You're sharing information. You're giving people game. Uh, when I worked with you on set, very positive. You know, no ego. So, so thank you for for showing us that it's possible and being an inspiration and and. It's motivating, man, just to see how consistent you've been throughout the years, the longevity. You got, man, you have stuff come, you got a movie coming out tomorrow. Uh, you're on deputy. So, uh, you know, props to you. Much, much, much respect. And just keep doing what you're doing. So thank you. Nah, man, chill, but you got no idea, bro. I got a lot of love and respect for you too, G. You come on set, you're humble as hell, you're cool as hell easy to talk to, you're approachable, and that's noticed, man, about you. And that's one of the most awesomest things in the world is that you make yourself approachable. Now, of course, there's right and wrong places for that sometimes, because sometimes you gotta be, and I get it, I get it. But I'm just making a point that when someone does approach you, I've always seen it, man, you've been cool, humble. Uh, and so, man, I just got a lot of, and, and dude, I saw you, man, like I saw you. I, I watch your comedy and stuff, you know, and I love it, bro, because. You're coming up in the game, and from where you were at to where you are now and where you're going, um, man, you're, you're off the hook, G. So I got a lot of respect for you, a lot of love for you. Low-key, when I was asked to be on your podcast, I ain't going to front. I, I was excited, bro. Uh, you know, for a minute, I was like, damn, I, I was forgotten in the chain, dog. So, oh. <laughs> so it, was a bless, it was a blessing to be on your podcast, G. Anytime, any place, I got Mad love and respect for you. And the last thing I'll say is this. Um, for the uh, the speaking event, if you ever want to get down with me on one, I'll most definitely let you know and you're more than welcome.